This is the HP touchpad take apart repair guide. The first step will be to swing the screen outwards to the left as shown in the video. For this we're going to use a metal pry tool to gently release the clips. We're going to pry in between the gasket and the back housing. A good method of releasing the clips is to use two pry tools. Gently get one edge up and then continue with the second. And then bunny hop it over. Once most of the clips are released on the right side, it'll pop up a small bit. Then need to work on the top and bottom. With all the clips released on the right side and top and bottom, we can now swing the screen outwards, being careful as it is still attached by three flex cables. The touchscreen digitizer is connected by two jaw connectors. Use a safe open pry tool to gently lift the back clip. For the LCD screen, simply pop up the connector. The screen assembly can now be gently pulled away from the connectors and removed from the rest of the device. The LCD screen is held in place with six small Phillips screws, which will need to be removed. With the screws removed, we can now remove the LCD screen from the rest of the screen assembly. We now need to heat the front of the touchscreen digitizer using a heat gun or a hair dryer. Use quick movements around the outside edges of the screen for about one minute. Now, using a metal pry tool, begin prying in between the gasket and the touchscreen, releasing all adhesive holding the touchscreen to the mid frame. Slide the pry tool through all four sides for releasing all the adhesive.
With all the adhesive released, we can now remove the midframe from the touchscreen. You can now replace your touchscreen digitizer.